Hello ladies and gentlemen, Marauder EX here back with more Let's Play Super Smash Bros. Ultimate World of Light. Alright, so I did back out and yeah, uh, everyone that we find here in World of Light is a playable character in the uh, rest of the game modes. So yeah, let's unlock Pac-Man so that he can join the party. So this time we're, we're going to take out the Pac. Win the battle to awaken the fighter. Ready? Go! I do love this new sword stance. Oh, nice! No. No, no. He is he is trying to be clever. I will also say one big thing about a Smash Brothers game is learning what their new AI is like. Because, uh... I have an expectation for Pac-Man, and he is, uh... He is not what I ever expected Pac-Man to be like. Like, I spent a fair bit of time going against the pack in, a. Uh, Come on, that was... Come on, what? I was doing so well a moment ago, and now he's just kind of like, Oh, yeah, no, no, I'm going to kick your ass. What? I should have hit him with that. Die. There we go. Dead. Come on, Pack. Be our friend. A lot of skill sphere. And some snacks. You'd, you'd figure Pac-Man would give the snacks. Alright. We have uncovered a new area. And we seem to have attracted Galeem's attention. What is he doing? Okay, that's new. There's some sort of little creepy vortex on the map that we need to go deal with. Okay. Sakura or Might? Oh, let's, let's do Sakura. Of course it's Isabel. Another time we gotta murder Isabel. Things that just, you know, scream, you're going to hell, murdering Isabel. Hey, that rhymes. Oh, it's Isabel and Corin. Wonderful. You know, just who I always wanted to deal with was both of them. I've actually never gone against Corin, because Corin was one of the characters in Smash for Wii U that I never picked up, because the DLC was obnoxious. I'm, I'm just, I'm getting wrecked. Oh god! <laughs> and it, and they're constantly healing. Yeah. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna do that one yet. Not gonna do that one yet. Let's go, let's go deal with the mites. Like, whoa. Defeat the main fighter when enemy heals over time. Yeah, that's... Defeat an army of fighters at Shadow Moses Island. That seems... And it's it's Mr. Game & Watch. Okay. Cute. Ready? Go! Oh, they're super tiny Game & Watches! Super tiny Game & Watch. I'm just going to keep bouncing you guys off the wall. And they move so slowly. And... 
Oh, that was fun. That was a very strong bounce. And just come on, kids, die. Just die. Alright, the boomerang's actually kind of hindering progress. You die, and... Because the first hit is making it difficult to... Alright, come on. There we go! Yes! Lightweight. Increases jump and move speed, but become easier to launch. And Eevee is level 69! Come on, make the joke. Alright, let's go south, since Corrin seems to be... a threat. Strangelove. Defeat the main fighter to win. Reinforcements will appear during the battle. The enemy is metal. I'm metal. Alright, so I gotta kill Bayonetta. Ready? Go! Pay no attention to the other reinforcements. And I hate Bayonetta. I've I've played against Bayonetta online once. Did that There weren't any other reinforcements. Okay. Sure. Okay. I was... See, that's the thing. Some of these fights are just like, oh yeah, by the way. <laughs> uh, what's going on on the menu? Oh, skill tree. I can, I can, uh... Well, I've got 20. I could do the neutral attack and start going that way. Defense when healthy. Endless smash hoarding. Uh, recovery items up. This is actually really neat. Well, we'll save some more of those. Oh, we get to go against roll. Ah. Uh, against Isabel. I, I have a feeling that this is going to end up just like the last Isabel fight. Take your strongest team into this no frills battle. And let's just launch that. Oh. So everyone's just going to get these. So let's just launch all of them into space, shall we? I'm just going to keep launching all of these. And... That's that's just gonna keep exploding. Come on, guys, land! Yeah, there we go. Land in the explosion. All right, so I need to stay away from that side because that's gonna explode here in a second. There. Didn't kill him with the explosion, but. We, we took them out. So we got roll. Shooting attack plus. Increases the power of projectile weapons such as bows or guns. I'm okay with that. Let's... I, I should probably see what the other spirits that I've got do. But let's go into this... What looks like... Military industrial complex. It's Andy from Advance Wars! The enemy is healed when the enemy is at high damage. Defeat an army of fighters. Oh, this is gonna suck. This is gonna suck. But it's neat, because that's what Andy does. He recovers troops, because Advance Wars! Ready, 
do I need to kill just Dr. Mario? Or do I, I need to kill all of them? Okay. However, this is, this is chaos. Because all of these explosions are a bit much. Alright, you guys just stay kind of over there. Oh, of course. Oh, God. ba -bom. I <laughs> Let's try that one again. The, the, the ba -bom walking towards me, that is, that is a, <laughs> that is a feeling every Smash player knows. It's like, you're getting ready to do an attack, and, oh, there's a ba -bom. I'm gonna hit the ba -bom. All right. That's, this is a lot of explosions coming at me, and I, I want, Uh, I want all of you to go away. Uh, snake! Tiny snake, leave me alone. Alright, the tiny snakes on the tiny... The, 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 the tiny little lift thingies are actually kind of adorable. Alright, that's... That is somewhat helpful. And... No, 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 no. That was actually quite helpful. Come on, guys. Come on down. And we're going to do that again. And critical hit you. And I'm going to bounce into that. Oh, you, you think you're cute. Come on, I've got a, a, a tiny snake. Can I not kill the tiny snake? Just one left. There we go. Tiny snake dead. And he is a primary. We'll get to see what he does. And several level ups, so... The gooey bomb. What's this? Blocked paths. In order to continue on certain paths, you may need help from a spirit well suited to dealing with the obstacle in your way. Looks like the lock on the gate can be opened somehow. Oh, so I've got to figure out who can open locks? All right, let's let's see. Can anyone like maybe Andy? Let's add Andy, and then we can do. We can start with a rage blaster. I don't really have any shooting attacks. Let's go ahead and use him. Alright, so we just got Andy. Maybe that... No? So I'll have to figure out who can do that. Whee! The running speed is ridiculous. Alright, let's try... Let's, let's try Isabel again. And this time we know not to go after Kor and just go after Isabel. And try to kill her as quickly as possible because she heals over time. Alright, come on, Isabel. No, nope, no, nope, none of that. Just. Uh, really? I cannot see that. That. Thing of her. The. Her attacks are actually really hard to see. But, hey, we did it. Who? It's it's the lure from the fishing pole. It's like, I can't... I couldn't see it half the time. But, hey, we get poison immunity. That's good. 
and some large snacks. So let's see what is this direction. And now I'm kind of regretting not picking up the strategy guide for Smash Brothers because like, they're making it so like, hey, yeah, you kind of need a, uh... oh, there's a switch, okay. Yellow Switch Palace. Leaf from Animal Crossing, L. Sure, let's try that. Alright, I'm at a disadvantage with Andy, so let's... Um, let's do that, and then we can add... We'll add a support. Let's try... Rabid Kong. I am at a significant disadvantage with the spirit here, so we'll see how that, how that plays into it, because that's also another thing that's probably playing into it that I'm not working on as much, that the spirit power is, you know, a factor. Come on, Diddy. Well. Berry immunity. I cannot be buried. Yeah, that was 12 levels. So, again, yeah, this difference in spirit, you know, kind of... Kind of plays a factor. So, alright. where There's the Switch Palace. Let's go... Muddy Mole... Take your strongest team into this battle. Okay. Muddy Mole. Ready? Go. Against Donkey Kong. And are we in the Great Cave Offensive? Is that what this one is? I think this is the Great Cave Offensive. Hey, look, berry immunity. Oh, sorry, donkey. Starts the battle with a drill. Cool. I can, I can, I can dig that. Waiting for applause for such an amazing joke. Venus, oh God. The floor is poisonous, the enemy is giant. Well, we just got someone who has poison immunity. <clears throat> As I am... I'm talking all... Alright, where... Well, Andy... Andy's at three slots. Let's do this. And... Where is our poison immunity friend? There you are. It takes two slots. Well, that's fine. We are now immune to poison. So screw you, Venusaur. Ready? Go! That actually was an interesting... Oh, even the, the voice clips are... Come on. Come on. How about you just stop and just die? Oh, that didn't hit. Ow. Well, you you're you're catching back up in damage, but I don't know why that killed you. That probably shouldn't have killed you. But hey, he's got fire weakness as you would imagine, which is why very few people actually picked Venusaur. Mo I, I, everyone I know from Gen 1, they picked Charizard or Squirtle. I don't know too many people who picked... Alright, let's see what that switch does. Oh, that opened something elsewhere. Okay. That seems really far away. Alright, well, I'm about out of time.
for now. So I'm going to try to figure out how I can get into this place here as Marth just books it into this what looks like military complex. So yeah, I'll try to figure that out and I will see you all in the next installment. So till then, later everyone.